Welcome to Business 101. It's presented by the Fremont Group. My name is Dirk Dieters, and I'm the executive director of the nonprofit Fremont Group. This is an introduction to the three-part webinars, which will be posted on our website and our blog. They are designed for anyone who owns their own business and is running their own business. The Fremont Group is a nonprofit organization. We've been serving small business owners since 2001. Our motto is, you only have what you give. It's of giving yourself that you grow rich. Our core business has always been small business management consulting. And in the past 10 years, we have added on an accounting division where we will do your QuickBooks accounting outsourced. Some of you may be familiar with Minding My Own Business, that webinar series and the book which I authored, uh, which also is used by our management consultants, our success partners, uh, is that Minding My Own Business is a, uh, identifies the six responsibilities of the small business owner and goes through those six responsibilities uh, in a little more of a broad general term. Business 101 is designed for the nuts and bolts of how you're supposed to run the business. And it is a uh, outline of the items that should be in your own operations manual. Every business does three things. You get the work in, you get the work out, and you keep track of it. Our three webinars in the future go through each one of those different processes. And it doesn't matter what industry you're in, everyone does exactly those three things things. We break those apart and we look at what are the key items in each one that should be documented so that uh, you can step away, other people can step in so that you can monitor things, all of the reasons why you document things in a business. As I said, all businesses do three things. You get the work in, you get the work out, and you keep track of it. The first in a series of the three webinars will be about getting the work in. Generally, we are talking about sales. Sales requires to have a system. Just like manufacturing or anything else, there are a system of steps that follow through that get you from a generating a lead to qualifying the lead to closing the lead to your customer service. How do you get your work in? Maybe you're doing it digitally, maybe you're doing it with salespeople, those things don't matter. But there needs to be a, a clear delineation of who is doing each one of those different functions, how they're going to be held accountable, what the expectations are, and where your bottlenecks are so that you can put your efforts into those bottlenecks. Getting the work out is depends, of course, on what it is you're, you're doing, but it is the production side. It is, it's the fulfillment. It is um, how do we actually perform what it is we are selling. And that, again, is a documented system of how does it flow. Uh, how do, if it's a uh, uh, manufacturing type position or a construction position, how do we uh, design? How do we double check it? How do we do change orders? How do we do What is the system and the workflow that requires you to get the work out the door. And then the third webinar, we'll look at keeping track of it. What is keeping track of it? It's really two different functions. One is the accounting side of it, and we'll deal with that extensively because there are different kinds of accounting that you need. And the second is your administrative side of it, keeping you in compliance uh, with the, the state and the feds and, and everybody else uh, that makes you keep track of those things and yourself, how you're keeping track of those things for managerial purposes, which can be entirely different. When you own a business, some people don't really understand what it is that you own. You don't own the people. We don't have slavery. In many cases, you don't even own your equipment or uh, uh, your other things. You're leasing or uh, uh, buying those on time. Uh, you don't probably may not even own your building that you're in because you're you're leasing your office. What is it you own? What is your business? Your business is a system. It's a system that takes market demand for your goods or services 
and then eventually con uh, converts that into cash in your bank. And if you, when we look at those three different processes, getting the work in, what are we talking about? Your sales system, how you go about uh, generating the sales. Uh, your pricing, how does that tie in with it? How do you advertise and market? What is your sales budget? Your budgeting for this, so make sure that the cost of, of uh, lead generation and so on is monitored. And how do you generate more sales from customer service? Sales creates, you have to create a predetermined mix of volume and of revenue. And also, and it's a mix of volume and revenue into your different profit centers, which may have different margins in them. So that that's what we look at in the first webinar, and that is getting that work in. In the second webinar, we look at getting your work out. How do you track it? How do you monitor it? How are we, what kind of productivity do we get out of our people? Are we getting the appropriate amounts of productivity? Incentives and accountability. You cannot have incentives for employees without accountability. They are a yin and a yang. How do you hold your people accountable? What, how, how can we, without losing them? What is your staffing plan? Uh, what kind of incentives are reasonable? How do we train them? Uh, how do we determine whether or not uh, it's a training issue or a personnel issue? Those are the different things we look at in getting the work out. In your operations, you need to produce those results within your budget and your standards of, of quality. And then the third webinar is the Keeping Track webinar. All three of these are vital. And this one, and without any one of the three, you're just not going to survive. People will overlook the third one. But how do we keep track of things? How do we do our change orders or job costing? Do we have a budget? The vast majority of the small businesses, over 4,000 of which I have been in over the last 20 years, if you really tie the owner down they, and ask them how they use their budget, they will admit to you that they don't use it or they don't even have one. The budget is the cornerstone of things and you can't keep track of anything unless you're comparing it to that. How do you handle your receivables and payables, your cash flow? Are you getting a six weeks cash flow forecast so you know where you stand? What kind of controls do you have in place for that? Are we using debt appropriately? And what kind of reporting does the owner actually get? Those are the things that make a difference. So it's been nice to introduce myself and our company to you. Business 101 will be a series of three videos that will be posted on our Patreon site, www.patreon.com slash the Fremont Group. On there, we will post each one of those three videos. It is a membership site. We do wish you to go to it. There's many more things on there besides just that. Uh, and also visit our website at www.tfginfo.org. Uh, we have offices in Denver and also in Tucson. You can call us anytime. We would be glad to talk. Uh, we are here to help, and that's what we're here. For. That's why we are working. Uh, we only have what we give. And it's by giving of ourselves that we grow rich. We'd like to see you on, join us on a webinar. Uh, give us a call and uh, also consider uh, uh, referring or using uh, our accounting services. Uh, we, can, we typically will end up doing a significantly improved job of your QuickBooks accounting and at about half the price of what it takes for an employee. So again, my name's Dirk Dieters. I'm the executive director of the Fremont Group. Check us out, give us a call, visit Patreon, and uh, we look forward to you following our Business 101 webinar series.